Severe weather is still threatening millions of Americans. Right now, at least 10 states are under tornado watches. The storms injured dozens in Michigan and even claimed a life in Oklahoma. ABC's Melissa Don has more on the aftermath. Millions of Americans dealing with yet another multi-day severe weather outbreak. At least 11 reported tornadoes just today in five states ranging from Kansas to Kentucky. People in Clarksville, Tennessee bracing for the worst. You can see it right there still. A large destructive tornado spotted near Spring Hill, Tennessee. And another sign of just how hyperactive that atmosphere is, a heavy hailstorm. The threat increasing after sunset with heavy rain expected. Flood watches issued across the Ohio and Tennessee valleys through tomorrow. In Hot Springs, Arkansas, this EF2 twister captured on camera. Cleanup is underway after severe storms ripped through southwest Michigan last night. The greater Kalamazoo area saw some of the worst of that weather with at least one confirmed tornado with winds up to 135 miles per hour, injuring dozens. A FedEx facility in Portage partially collapsed in the storm that ripped off both the roof and the front of the building. 50 people trapped inside, all making it out alive. ABC's Alex Perche is on the ground in Michigan. So we're about a half mile from that FedEx plant that was completely destroyed, and you're seeing a similar outcome in this neighborhood. The garage was coming off the foundation, ripped the insulation out of the house, ripped the door clean off the side of the building. Michigan's governor Gretchen Whitmer declaring a state of emergency. The devastation's real. There are a lot of displaced families. While families work to rebuild, crews are cleaning up and restoring power after thousands lost electricity. Melissa Adon, ABC News, Los Angeles.